Empty chamber. The SKS semi-automatic 10-shot Russian design semi-automatic rifle is one of the best-selling rifles uh, in in the U.S. at this time, and has been for the past several years. The um, the caliber is 7.62 by 39, which is the same as the AK-47. In fact, this gun was designed in 1945, and then it wasn't very long after that, and I believe it was 1947, that the uh, AK-47 took over uh, as the uh, Soviet bloc and Chinese uh, communist uh, main battle rifles or carbines. But these guns actually are very, they're milled to really tight specs. They're very nice, very accurate rifles. Uh, you can see here, this is a 10-shot uh, box magazine. You uh, feed the gun through the top here, top load, 10 rounds, stripper clip here. Uh, it just They just fit right down in. The good thing is, is uh, you can see the quality of this bolt and everything. But for, Matt, for, for your release, ammo release, you can just pop this lever back, drop your ammo out. So... Uh, Another nice feature. Safety is right here. Flip up safety. Very positive. There's a cleaning kit in the butt of the rifle. This little plate pushes in. Kit pops out with uh, with your brushes and etc. Just a neat little hideaway here. Spring pops the plate back up. As you can see, the sights has adjustments. Oops, sorry. Different adjustments here for your meters. Then we have your front sight, which is just open globe top sight with an insert. Bayonet, which a, some of them don't have the bayonets because of the assault weapons ban, but all this needs to do is spring loaded, push it down, pull it out, lift it up right over your barrel. As you can see, it just because you didn't see that. There we go. They have the blade. This is a blade fixed bayonet. It also has the uh, spiked bayonet on some models. Here's your cleaning rod right here. It's just held in by tension. But these are really excellent rifles. This particular model is a Russian and these bring quite a bit more than your average SKS. When these first came into the country you could get them for $59. Uh, but now they're ranging around 300, 350. I know some of the Romanians or the Yugoslavians are about 350. They're a little nicer, but um, these run about 800. They're a little more expensive and a little more well-made. The Russian originals. So anyway, we're going to do a little shooting. Hope you enjoy. But an excellent rifle that I highly recommend for anyone who loves to shoot. Forgotten how nice those were. The best way to reload SKS though is a stripper clip. But this is manually. I didn't bring my strippers. I left them at home with my wife. <laughs> It'll hold 10 rounds. Thank you, buddy. It just feeds right into this little. You can get extended mags to 20. Uh, I've not really tested to see if they're that accurate. Okay, now I'm going to pull this up before I load the clip, but as you can see, this is where the stripper goes. In fact, probably when I get back to the shop, I'll uh, demonstrate that for you.